Hey, what's up? It's me, JDS4696, and today I'm giving a discussion on the recent re uh, reveal of the, uh, the second Star Wars trailer for uh, The Force Awakens, which is, you know, episode 7 of uh, the Star Wars like film series. But they're really just calling it uh, The Force Awakens at this point, which is like the title of the film. But yeah, I'm basically just giving like a like a discussion on the trailer, and I may eventually do like a a trailer reaction to it eventually, you know. But uh, I think the trailer it, it looked pretty cool, and I'm still kind of like disappointed that the, uh, these new Star Wars films they're not following like the uh, the expanded universe of the novels. And I was always a big fan of like the Star Wars like novels that take place kind of what when they first started they were after Return of the Jedi kind of. And then they got like the, the ones that kind of take place during the prequel era too, you know. But yeah, they, they, at this point they're not really following the expanded universe so stuff like the Yuuzhan Vaughn, like the aliens, you know, that evaded like the Star Wars universe, you know, and stuff like that. They're not really following that. And even like the death of certain like major characters, you know, they're not really following that at this point. It's, this is basically like a uh, kind of continue where Return of the Jedi left off. So, you know, they continue on from that point, basically. But the Star Wars, the Star Wars film series is my favorite like film franchise. So no matter what, I'm really still like excited about it, you know, because um, the idea that you have like a uh, characters like Luke Skywalker, like Han Solo and Princess Leia and Chewie, you know, all of them like returning to the film series, like, that is cool, you know. And like the look of the film, I like how the, um, they have it looking like how the original trilogy did look, you know. It kind of looks like it's based in that world, not really the prequel tr trilogy, you know. They're like it's based more in uh, like how like the original trilogy was, and I kind of like how they're doing that. It's cool. It's cool to see them return to that form of it, you know. But like I say, uh, the trailer looks cool. Like this new trailer looks very cool. Like you know, it has like a. Uh, I guess this is Luke Skywalker. You see, because he's like cloaked or whatever, and you see he's like touching like R two and stuff like that. I know you hear his voiceover too that, uh, from uh, Return of the Jedi when he was talking to Princess Leia and he was saying that, you know, the force is strong in my family, you know, my sister has it, I have it, you know. I thought that was kind of cool because I was the same lines that like Mark Hamill used as Luke Skywalker in Return of the Jedi. Because I remember they was in like the Ewok village when he was telling her that, you know. And he revealed to her at that point that she was his sister. I didn't want to spoil it for people who probably know, haven't seen like Return of the Jedi or anything. Plus another thing is cool. They show like <laughs> they show like Harrison Ford as Han Solo, and you know he's like aged or whatever. He got like gray hair and stuff, but he's next to like Chewbacca, and I, I thought that was kind of like a cool touch. Cause like your first glimpse of, of actually seeing them too as well, you know. Cause at the last trailer they didn't show them. They was basically showing like new characters, like the new Sith Lord they have in it, which they show again too, like the new Sith Lord. He has he has a name too, but I, I forget what his name is. It, it, it was something. But I, I know he has like a name or whatever because he has like he's introducing this new like lightsaber too into like the Star Wars like universe which has like like three blades on it like one that goes up like that and like two on the side. But yeah, uh, and other than that, it shows like uh, I think it showed like more like show more X wings and stuff like that which are cool. It shows like a desert. Now the opening of the trailer shows like a huge like Star Destroyer that apparently has crashed into like the desert. I think that's Tatooine. I'm not really sure, but I think it's like Tatooine, you know. But uh, and that that's that's kind of interesting, cause like whoa, what brought down a star destroyer? Well, anything could kind of bring them down, you know, like anything like powerful enough <laughs> could kind of bring down like a star destroyer. So, so I'm kind of curious about what did that, you know. But the look of it, it looks cool, but I'm still just kind of like disappointed that they're not really, they're not going to really, they, they're borrowing stuff from like the expanded universe of like novels and stuff, but they're not really following those, and that was kind of like a, a major disappointment for me, you know. But so far, I'm, I'm still like anticipating Star Wars, the, uh, the Force Awakens, and I think the trailer looks exciting and good, and even more images of like the new Sith Lord that they have in the film, like him swinging and stuff, you know, and more looks at the Stormtroopers and stuff, I think that's kind of cool. And they are taking elements from the expanded universe, like uh, Jason Solo and uh, Jaina Solo, who are the kids of uh, Han Solo and Princess Leia. They, they are bringing them into like the film, you know. So they, they they are borrowing like elements from like the expanded universe of novels, you know. But like a lot of the stuff they like, they're not considering canon at this point. And I was always a fan of the novels, you know. I've read so like many of them, you know, over like the years, almost like in like for, like twenty years, I've read like those Star Wars novels, you know. 
and now they're, they're choosing not to really like follow them that's that's kind of disappointing but i'm still looking forward it's like this is my favorite video franchise star wars you know so i'm really i'm excited for looking for it and i may still like give like a trailer reaction to uh, the star wars the force awakens which is episode seven and this is the start of a new trilogy you know there supposed to be two more films like a uh, eight and a nine they're supposed to do as well but this is episode seven so yeah, I'm still looking forward to Star Wars The Force Awakens, and this is a JDS 4696. Alright.